Good morning. Good morning, everybody. Welcome to the third series of uh, uh, Upanishads by our uh, 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 Dr. C.S.R. Prabhugaru. Let us start with Prarthana by Dr. Vishalakshmi. Oh. ओम शुक्लांबरधर विष्णु शचिवर्ण चतुर्भुज प्रसन्न वदनम छायाघ्नोपात ओं गणा गणपति हवामे कवि कवीना उपमश्रवस्तम ज्येष्ठराज ब्रह्मण ब्रह्मणस्पत आन शृण्वन्ति सीदसाधन ओं श्री महागणाधिपत नम ओं गुरूर्ब्रह्म गुरुर्विष्णु गुरुर्देव महेश्वर गुरसाक्षात्ब्रह्म तस्म श्रीगुरव नम ओं प्रणोदेवी सरस्वती वाजे फिर्वाजिनी वती ृवत ओं श्री महासरस्वत नम ओं सत्यम वद धर्म चरा स्वाध्यान्मा प्रमद मातृदेव भव पितृदेव भव आचार्य देव भव अतिथिदेव भव ओं असतो मा सदमय तमसो मा ज्योतिर्गमय मृत्योर्मा अमृत गमय ओं शाति 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 ओं सदाशिव सरंभा व्यासंकर मध्यम अस्मदाचार्य पर्यता वंदे गुरुपरंपरा ओं सहना सहनौन सह वीर करवाह तेजस्वीनावतीतमस्तु मिद्विषा वह ओं शाति 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 धन्यवाद डॉक्टर विशालक्षी महोदय नौ आई विल रिक्वेस्ट डॉक्टर प्रभुजी टू स्टार्ट हिज वेबिनार ओ शो मित्र शुण शोभवत्म शो बृहस्पति शो विष्णुक्रम नमो ब्रह्मण नमस्ते वायो वाये प्रत्यक्ष ब्रह्मासी तामेव प्रत्यक्ष ब्रह्म वदिष्या सत्यम वदिष्या ऋत वदिष्या सत्यम वदिष्या तन्मावत तद्वक्तावत अवत मवत वक्ता ओ शाति 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 यजुर्वेदीय तैत्रीयोपनिषत् This is Pradhamanuvakaha of the Pradhamarjaya. It has got uh, three parts. First is on education, Shiksha Valli. Second is on Ananda, bliss, Ananda Valli, and third is Prabhu's discovery journey on the nature of Brahman under the guidance of his father Varuna. so the main character here is bhrugu and varuna his father shiksham vyakhyasyamaha varna swaraha matra balam sama santanah ityukta shiksha adhyayah <coughs> so education shiksha <coughs> is explained as varnas swaras matras they comprise the chanting 
you know what is varna what is swara what is matra and the continuation is called santana i will be reading out uh, much of it because it's very big uh, upanishad and i will explain only certain portions not all portions because it will be very big it will not be finished in one day today is the last day of upanishads as suggested by some others also if at all we have a next level course then we can have more detailed upanishads maybe one month or two months or three months where other speakers also will be there we have not planned as yet that it may come out if everything is worked out sahano yashah sahano brahma varchasam adhat samhitaya upanishadam vyakhyasya maha panchaswadhikaraneshu adhilokam adhijyotisham adhividyam adhiprajamadhyatmam tamaha samhita ityajakshate adha adhilokam prithivi purva roopam jaur uttara roopam akash sandhi vayu sandhanam ityadhi lokam adha adhijyotisham agni purva roopam aditya uttara roopam apassandhi vaidyuta sandhanam ityadhi jyotisham adhadhi vidyam acharya purva roopam ante vanyuttara roopam vidya sandhi pravachanam sandhanam ityadhi vidyam adhadhi prajam mata purva roopam pita uttara roopam praja sandhi prajanagam sandhanam ityadhi prajam adhadhyatmam adharahanu purva roopam uttarahanu ruttara roopam vaak sandhi jihva sandhanam ityadhyatmam iti ma mahahim samhita ya eva meta mahasamhita vyaksha tam ved sandhiyate prajaya pashubhi ब्रह्मवर्चसेनाख्यायते प्रजया पशु ब्रह्मवर्चसेनाध्यन सुवर्गेण लोकेन एक्सप्लेनिंग दि five different uh, conjunctions sandhis if you take the first uh, adhi lokam we have prithivi lokam as purva roopam earth and jau jau is the space uh, akasham jau antarikshakam there are two like antarikshakam is space so before space whatever is there what we call sky so prithvi purva roopam earth is on previous side and akasha is on jau is on the other side and akasha is in between antariksham is again different so between the earth and jau java prithivyor idarantaram hi vyaptatvaye kena disascha sarvaha in the visharupa arjuna is explaining how the lord is pervading the entire universe all the sky and space and the antariksham everything so the, the prithvi and the in between is akasha so that is prithvi akasha dya this is akasha is sandhi the link between prithvi and dya dya lokam so that is adhi lokam this is first level that is the the conjunction is vayu because vayu is there in the atmosphere he is referring to atmosphere outer and inner space and outer space dyau is something like inner space 
Antaraksham is outer space. And now coming to Jyotisham, light. The conjunction of Jyoti, Agni Purva Rupam, because all Jyoti is basically Agni only. Aditya Uttara Rupam, Aditya is sun. And Apa Sandhi, and there is a conjunction which is Apa. Because you know, the lightning comes, that's how the Apa comes. The, when the lightning comes in uh, Akasha, then Apa gets generated. Vaibjuta Sandha, lightning is Vaibjuta. Vidyut, that is Sandhanam, conjunction, link. Idi Adhi Yoshitam, Atha Adhi Vidyam, now Vidya. <coughs> Education process, who is the first? Tell me, student or teacher, who is the first? Yes, anybody can answer. Teacher is the first. Acharya Purva Rupam. Now, unless I teach, you cannot listen. The student cannot understand. So, Acharya Purva Rupam. Anteva Suttara Rupam. Anteva means the, a person who resides inside the Gurukulam. It's called Anteva. He is Uttara, the next. And what is the conjunction between them? Vidya. Education is the link. And that's conjun that link is established through lecture. Pravachanagam Sandhana. Simple, right? It's a beautiful model of education. Itya Adhividyam. <coughs> Similarly, Praja. <coughs> Mata Purva Rupam. Pita Uttara Rupam. Praja Sandhi. <coughs> Prajanaragam Sandhanam. The delivery, the reproductive process is the Sandhanam. Mata is the previous, Pita is the later. And Praja, the child is the conjunction between Mata and Pita. Now coming to Adhyatnam, we have the lower jaw and upper jaw. Adharahanu, Pura Rupam. Uttarahanu, Uttara Rupam. Vak Sandhi. Vak, speech is coming with two jaws interaction. Jihva Sandhan. Without tongue, no speech will come out. Itya Adhyatnam. The Maha Samhita Vyakhyata, he who understands this will be blessed with Prajaya, with children, with animals, and Brahma Varchasa, and going to higher levels of living. Now, <coughs> very famous statements are there in this Upanishad. Yas Chanda Samrishabho Vishwarupaha. Chandobhyo adhyamrata sambhabhuva samendro medhaya srunotu amrutasya devadharano bhuyasam shariram me vicharshanam jihva me madhumuttama karnabhyam bhuri visruvam brahmanakko shosi medhaya vihita apividha srutam me gopaya Avahanti Vitvana Nvana Kurvana Chira Matmana Vasagam Namaga Vashchanna Paneja Sarvada Tatome Shriyamavaha Lomasham Pasavhissaha Swaha Amayastu Brahmacharina Swaha Avimayantu Brahmacharina Swaha Apramayantu Brahmacharina Swaha Adamayantu Brahmachari Naswaha Akshamayantu Brahmachari Naswaha Yeshojane Saniswaha Sreyosya Syo Saniswaha Tamtwa Bhaga Pravishaniswaha Sama Bhaga Pravishaswaha Dasmin Sahaprashake Sahatsa Prashake Bhagahum Twayim Rujes Swaha Ayadhapa Pravatayanti Yadhamapa Ahajaram Evam Mam Brahmacharina Dhatara Yantu Sarvata Swaha Prati Vesho Ani Pramapa Hi Pramapadat Padvas Padjasya Vitanvana Shamayantu Brahmacharina Swaha Adhatara Yantu Sarvata Swaha now he is explaining the 
the, the sankalpas of a guru he is inviting the students brahmacharis from all directions who are very good in qualities who have shama adama other qualities bhor bhuvasvarita iti va eta strisho vyahrutaya in sanjavandanam we have vyahrutis for the gayatri mantra bhu bhuva swa and of course we have seven uh, also bhu bhuva swa maha janaha tapah satyam so sapta vyahruti gayatri or tris vyahruti gayatri so what are these bhu bhuva swa he is elaborating commenting in detail three vyahrutis tasa am uhat ohasmaitam chaturdhim maha cha manya pravedayate maha iti the fourth is maha tad brahma sa atma that is brahman that is atman anga nyanya devata <coughs> bhuriti vayam lokah bhuvarity antariksham suvarity asau lokah maha itya adityah <coughs> aditye sava Aditya Navacha Sarve Loka Mahiyante. The seven levels. Bhuritiyam Loka. This Bhu Loka. Okay. Bhuvarityantariksham. The space is Bhuva. Swaritiyasav Loka. Mahitya Aditya. At the level of sun, Aditya is Mahar Lokam. Before that is Swar Lokam. And before that is Bhuvar Lokam and then it is Bhu Lokam. What we are standing is Bhu Lokam. Aditya Navasarve Lokam Hiyante. By sun, all the Lokas are being held. Bhuvaritiva Agnihi, Bhuvaritiva Yuhu. This is one interpretation, the Lokas interpretation. The other interpretation is Bhu is Agni, Bhuvaiti Vayu. Suvarita Aditya Mahaiti Chandrama Chandrama Sava Sarva Jyotish Jyoti Shimahiyate. So this is another interpretation. Bhuvaiti Vayu Suvarita Aditya Mahaiti Chandrama and then all other stars, Jyotisha stars. Bhuvariti Va Richaha Bhuvariti Samani. Suvariti Yajumshi Mahaiti Brahma Brahmana Bhava Sarve Veda Mahiyante. Another interpretation for Bhu Bhuvaswama is Bhu is Rigveda, Bhuva is Samaveda, and Suva is Yajurveda, and Maha is Brahman, and Brahmana Bhava Sarve Veda Mahi. In Brahman, what we mean by Brahma is all Vedas. So, Brahmana is a person who has Brahma Jnana. Brahma Jnana Iti Jnana Jnana Iti Brahmana. Yutpati of Brahmana Sabda. So, what is Brahma? Brahma is absolute reality. Satyam Jnana Manantam Brahma. Also, Veda. Veda also means, is conveyed by Brahma. Brahma means Veda. So, a person who knows Veda is Brahmana. A person who knows Brahman, Brahma Jnana, he is also Brahman. Both are same. Because Veda talks about Brahma Vidya only. Bhu Ritavai Pranaha, another interpretation. Bhu means Prana. Bhuva Iti Apanaha. Bhuva is Apana. Suva Iti Vyanaha. Suha is Vyana. Maha Iti Annam. Agne Nava Sarve Prana Mahi Yante. So within the physiological system of the human body or other bodies or in the universe, we have the Prana. So Pancha Pranas are there of which he is referring to Bhu as Prana and Bhu as Apana. Prana, Apana, Vyana, Udana, Samana, Pancha Pranas. So he is explaining Bhu is Prana, Bhu is Apana, Suva is Vyana and Maha is Annam. Annam means food in general. Annenava Sarve Prana Mahiyante. All living beings thrive and sustain on Anna only. Tava etas chatas chatasras chaturdha chatasras chatasro vyahrutaya. So these four vyahrutis is explained. Ur bhuva suva maha. 
He has not explained all others in all contexts. Tayo Veda Saeda Saveda Brahma. If you understand this, then you understand Brahman. Sarvasmai Deva Balima Mahanti Apolo Asau Loko Yajumshi Veda Dvecha Chaston Vakasahesho Antar Hudaya Akasha Tasmin Nayam Purusho Mano Maya Amruto Hiran Maya Antarena Taluke Yaesha Stanaivarambate Mendra Yonihi Yatraso Keshan Toni Vivatate Yapo Hyasir Shakapale Burit Yagno Pratitishati Bhuvariti Vayo Suvarit Yaditye Mahaiti Brahmani Apnoti Swarajam Apnoti Manasas Patim Vak Patis Chakshus Pati Shrotra Pati Vijnana Pati Etato Bhavati Akasagum Sadiram Brahma Satyatma Pranaramam Anandam Shanti Samrudhama Amrutam iti prachina yogyo paswa vayava amrutamekam cha prithivyam pariksham yaur dishova antariksha disha agnir vayur adit chandrama nakshatrani apa oshatayo vanaspataya akasha atma it yadibhutam. What is adibhutam? Adibhutam. Adidaivikam. We chant three shantis, right? Om Shanti, Shanti, Shanti. Why three times? Why not five times? Because three are referring to Adi Bhautika, Adi Daivika, and Adhyatmika realms. Shanti for all the three realms. Because we, we live and operate in three realms Adi Bhautika, Adi Daivika, and Adhyatmika. What is Adi Bhautika level, physical level? Prudhivi, first earth. Antariksham space, the in between, Dishova, all directions, Antar Dishaha, intermediate direction, eight, eight Dishas are there. Agnihi, Vayuhu, Adityaha, Chandrama, Nakshatrani, all stars, Apa, all liquids, Oshadhaya, all plants, Vanaspada, all trees, Akasha, oh, and finally Atman, that is myself, self. All this put together is called Adhibhutam or Adhibhautikam. Now he is going to explain Adhyatma. Adhyatma, Prano, Vyano, Apana, Udana, Samana, Chakshu, Shrotram, Mano, Vak, Twak, Charmam, Agumsa, Sasna, Vas, Asti, Majja, Eta, Adhividhaya, Rushirovachat. Pankam by the gum sarvam, Pankena eva pankam spronoti sarvame gumcha. So, what is Adhyatmam? That is myself, comprising the self. Atma means self. Self is comprising of Panchapranas, Prana, Vyana, Apana, Udana, Samana, and then Chakshuhu, Srotram, Mano, Manas, Vak, Twak, Charmam, Agum, Sna, Sasna, that is this. And asti, all the bones, majja, the marrow in the bones. Eta davidhidaya, rushi rovachat. I think the medical doctors can understand what is being conveyed here. The entire body is the essence, dhatus are being explained. So, this is all about adhyatmam. So, he has already explained adhibhutam, adhyatmam. Adi Daivikam he has previously explained. He is now not explaining again. Now he is going to some of the most profound Brahma Jnana. Well, friends, I want to tell you very clearly, as Lalita Ji has conveyed and some others also conveyed to me by WhatsApp, you have reached uh, extraordinary levels of spiritual, sublime, more or less blissful state yesterday in the Upanishads and today also we will be reaching. Because Upanishads are giving the ultimate truth, the very essence of the ultimate truth, Sruti, that is the, the pure knowledge, pure Jnanam. So when you get that pure Jnanam, I am actually reading out and explaining, but we are all going to that level which is being conveyed here in the Upanishads, Sruti. So when you, and what, it is merged with Veda. 
Upanishad and Veda are merged. But all I chanted is Vedic mantras. And sometimes it is prose, sometimes it is poetry. Now he is explaining the entire Brahma Jnanam. If you get Brahma Jnanam, you will get liberated. Jnana Mukti Hi. So if you want to get liberation, the main purpose of this entire process, this course and these lectures and this Upanishad, everything is, what is the final goal? It is not Ardha Kama. It is Moksha. Dharma and Moksha. Only two things. Ardha Kama, after 8 o'clock, you will be very busy throughout day and night. But up, this period is for Moksha only. And that Moksha will come through Jnana. So <clears throat> what is that Jnana? Yesterday we have discussed in the Mandukya Upanishad. What is self? What is Om? Now he is again coming to that topic in the Taitri Upanishad. Om iti Brahma. Om is Brahma. That is absolute reality. Nirguna Brahman. Whose subset is Saguna Brahman. Whose subset is Ishvara. Whose subset is Devata or Ishta Devata. Om iti Idagam Sarvam. Everything which you see is Om only. Similar to what was told yesterday in Mandukya Upanishad. Om ityeta anukruti hasma vapyo shravayetya shravayanti Om iti samani gayanti Om shom iti shastrani shagunsanti Om iti adhvar yuk pratigaram pratigrunati Om iti brahma prasauti Om iti agnihotra manujanati Om iti brahmana pravakshan naha Brahmopa, Brahmopa, Pnuani, the Brahmaiva, Pnoti, Om Dasha. So, Om is used in different, different contexts. Om is used for hearing, for pleasant hearing. Om is used in Samaganam, music. And Om is used in the Deliverance of astras. When they when Arjuna delivers say Brahmastra, he'll start with Om. Om Shom. Of course, we don't know those mantras are sacred. Shastani Shamsanti. Om it's Advaryu Pratigaram Pratikati. Advaryu means in the Yajna. The person who organizes everything. Advaryam means he organizes. He is Yajurvedya Brahmana. Yajurveda is giving the Advaryu functional role. So there again, he starts with Om only. Om iti Brahma Prasauti. Om iti Agnihotra Manujana. When you say Om, it is also conveying Agnihotra. When, uh, when they open the uh, Agnihotra in the early morning, we'll, they'll start with Om only. And what is wonderful is not only <clears throat> in the Vedic Sanatana Dharma, but even in Buddhist and Jain also, they start with Om only. So what is the profundity of Om? It's not just a Hindu religious symbol, but it's a universal symbol. And some people say it is also there in Christianity and Islam as Amen. <coughs> or Amin. Tapaschaswadhyaya pravachanecha, damaschaswadhyaya pravachanecha, shamaschaswadhyaya pravachanecha, agnayaschaswadhyaya pravachanecha, agnihotranchaswadhyaya pravachanecha, adhyaschaswadhyaya pravachanecha, manushamchaswadhyaya pravachanecha, prajachaswadhyaya pravachanecha, prajanaschaswadhyaya pravachanecha, prajapatischaswadhyaya pravachanecha, Satya Midi Satya Bachara, Vitaraha, Tapai de Tapo Nityaha, Paurisishi, Swadhyaya Pravachene, Neveti, Nasho Maud Kalyaha, Tadhita Pasta, Dhita Baha, Prajaja Swadhyaya Pravachene, Shatcha. No Swadhyaya and Pravachana. What does this mean? Swadhyaya means study, good study. Pravachana is delivering lecture explanation. So these two comprise the entire life, entire education. Because Ritam, Ritam is Vedic word for Dharma. Dharma is this set of laws 
law law of universe and rutam the word dharma is not there in the veda instead of it rutam is there the same rutam became rhythm in english rhythm r h y t h that is there is a cyclic rhythm so rutam rutam cha swadhyaya pravachane cha satyam cha swadhyaya pravachane rutam satyam param brahma brahma is rutam and satyam and both are through swadhyaya and pravachana and tapa also is through swadhyaya and pravachana swa tapas cha swadhyaya pravachane cha damas cha swadhyaya self control dama discipline is again through swadhyaya and pravachana learning and teach shamas cha swadhyaya pravachane cha shama is peace agnayas cha all the agnihotras you know various yajna process again through swadhyaya and pravachana agnihotram cha swadhyaya pravachane cha atidhayas cha swadhyaya pravachane cha atidhi the guess manusham cha swadhyaya pravachane cha all human activities prajanas cha swadhyaya even the reproductive process is through learning and teaching prajapati cha swadhyaya pravachane prajapati is brahma the creator is also through prav swadhyaya and pravachane satyam iti satya vachara adhitara tapa iti tapo nitya paurishti swadhyaya pravachane iti venako maudgalhya tadhi tapas tadhi tapa prajaj swadhyaya pravachane cha aham vrakshasya reriva kirti prashtham gireriva urdha savitro vajini pasvamrutam asmi amrutam asmi i am immortal dravina gumsu vachasam sumedha amrutokshitah iti trishanko vedanu vachanam trishanko made these statements aham vrakshasya reriva kirti prashtham gireriva i am like a huge tree my my reputation kirti he is like a big mountain rock urdha svitro vajini amrutam asmi i am immortal dravinam suvarchanam sumedha amruto akshitah iti trishankor veda anuvachanam aham shat now ekadasha anuvakah in the dasha anuvakah trishanku made this profound statement and the ekadasha anuva the 11th chapter anuvaka of the first uh, part of uh, satri upanishad is a very very popular crucial and extraordinary section just now we have heard in the beginning of the prayer matru devo bhava pitru devo bhava vishalakshi garu has chanted i want to ask all of you from where that has come do you know because we always tell matru devo pitru devo acharya devo go ati devo from where it has come it has come from here this ekadasha anuvaka which is the snataka adesha that is convocation address what is snataka convocation when this uh, students finish their education and they leave the education institute and go out and get married or take up jobs and go do whatever they want this snatakam is for them so that convocation because in marriage also before marriage snatakam is for them because that is convocation for that boy so after finishing education he will become grihastha brahmacharya grihastha i want to ask you another question why in english we say bachelor degree bachelor of arts bachelor of science bachelor of engineering why because brahmacharya even those fellows were our people only long back so brahmacharya ashram the education completion so they when they finish it before finishing they are bachelor after that they get married snatakam then vivaham so that snataka convocation address is given here what i am going to chant now and i'm very very happy to inform you that the triple it hyderabad at the chiboli has adopted this snataka panyasam as their convocation address and my son got his masters degree in research in uh, computer science in triple it hyderabad i was pleasantly surprised when they chanted this same taitri upanishad ekadash anuvakam which is the convocation address of the ancient times and they printed it they gave translation they have chanted it and given to everybody and also made all the 
students wear dhoti and sari for girls to come to the stage and take the degree and in the whole world only tripura hyderabad has done it all other people continue with the old british method of having that gown and that hat and all that nonsense now let us see what wonderful orders are being given taitri upanishad is very famous because this convocation address is not just only for students but it is for the entire world if you follow that you will be free from all problems in entire world ved manusu uchacharyo ante vasinam anushasti acharya will give this order to the ante vasi that is the students who have finished the vedic vedadhyanam satyam vada the first order is speak truth dharmanchara follow dharma swadhyayan ma pramada never be lazy or careless or complacent about swadhyaya that is learning you keep on learning all your life even ramkrishna paramhansa said i learn as long as i live acharya ya priyam dharma hrutya prajatantum ma vyavachet si after having given the guru dakshina you go and uphold your lineage prajatantum ma vachet si don't allow your lineage your father grandfather yourself and next should be your son and his son and his son and so on you shall develop that that means get married prajatantum ma vyavachet si you shall not break the lineage of your family in fact that is the purpose of marriage to to procreate a child son for the upholding of that family lineage and uh, otherwise you can uh, all of us can become sanyasis if everybody can become sanyasi then there will be no society no people at left in this world so to uphold this human race and the familial lineage we get married that is the purpose of marriage he is telling that prajatantum ma vyavachetsi satchanna pramaditavyam that means you marry and procreate children and while doing all that in your whole life satyanna pramaditavyam don't be complacent about truth truth is the ultimate and greatest dharmanna pramaditavyam don't be complacent about dharma today people neither follow satya nor dharma satya dharma pratishthaya that is but everybody has to aim all of us has to aim at upholding satya and dharma kusalanna pramaditavyam welfare don't be complacent about welfare kushala <coughs> bhutyaina pramaditavyam bhuti is grander greatness you go on growing to grand grand levels don't be complacent about your growth swadhyaya pravachana abhyam ma pramaditavyam don't be complacent about both learning and teaching you know if you keep on learning and don't teach why am i doing this course here why am i delivering this course why am i teaching? because this pravachanam swadhyaya pravachana abhyam ma pramaditavyam you shall not be complacent about learning and teaching deva pitrukarya abhyam na pramaditavyam don't be complacent about deva karya that is all puja and uh, upasana and all other deva karyas and also pitrukaryas pitrukarya means for the dead ancestors performing the shraddha karma and other things both are equally important mostly our people are very happy to perform deva karya the various pratams and pujas but they are they are not interested in doing pitrukarya but here the shruti is very clear in ordering that both are equally important deva pitrukarya abhyam ma pramaditavyam matru devo bhava here it's where it was told first time and we are just copying it without knowing from where it has come let your mother be your devata matru devo bhava pitru devo bhava that means you do upasana aradhana of your matru devata first and then pitru devata because because of them you have come into existence in this world then acharya devo bhava atidhi devo bhava yan yanavajjani karmane tani sevitavyani no itarani what all actions you will perform in your life not whatever you like but what has been given as a role model anavadyani which are praiseworthy actions karmani tani sevitavyani no itarani english no and sanskrit no are same not others 
not anything and everything. Yes. Yasya Asmagam Sucharitani Tan Payopasyani. Sucharitani. Good characters. Those who have good charitra, like Rama or Harishchandra, only such role models you shall follow. No itarani, not all other donkey, monkey kind of role models which our youth follow. Yecha asme chreyam so brahmana tesham payane na prashvasitavyam shraddhaya deyam. You shall give charity donation to brahmanas with shraddha. Shraddhaya deyam. Asraddhaya adeyam. No, don't give it asraddha. Sriya deyam. Priya deyam. Priya deyam. Samvida deyam. With knowledge, with happiness, with pleasantness, with wealth, you shall give. Because what will you do if you don't give? Nothing. The education will not happen. Yadite karma vichikitsa va vritti chikitsa va syat. Ye tatra brahmana sammarshina. Yukta yukta aluksha dharma kama su. Yadate tatra varte. Now, whenever there is a complicated situation in society, this happened, that happened, what to do, what to do, what to do. That time, the Brahmanas, the Brahmajanis, the Rishis are available to guide you what is to be done, what is not to be done, to resolve and do whatever they say. Aluksha Dharma Kama Suhu Yathate Tatravartere and also take the role models of how such Brahmajnanis have performed, our Rishis have performed actions and taken steps in those complicated situations in the past. So you take the precedence. He is giving the entire judicial evaluation process, the precedence of law. Yetatra Brahmana Sammarshinha Yukta Yukta Luksha Dharma Kamasyu Tadha Te Teshuvar Teran Tadha Teshuvar Tedha Esha Adeshaha Whatever has been told till now is the order. Esha Upadeshaha is the injunction, is the teaching. Esha Veda Upanishad. This is Veda and this is Upanishad. Eta Dhanushasanam. This is the law. Eva Mupasitavyam. You shall implement it, follow it, practice it without fail. Eva Mucheta Dupasyam. Svadhyaya Pravachanabhyam. Naparamaditavyam. Finally, is repeating. Don't ever stop learning and teaching. So this is the Shikshavalli, friends. Now we get to the Shanti Mantra of the Shikshavalli. Om Stanno Mitrasham Varunaha Shanno Bhavatvar Yama Shanna Indro Bruhaspati Shanno Vishnu Rurukramaha Namo Brahmane Namaste Vayo Swameva Prachaksham Brahmasi Swameva Prachaksham Brahmavadisham Rutamavadisham Pasatyamavadisham Tanmama Vit Tadvaktarama Vit Avid Maam Avid Vaktaram Om Shanti 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 Sam Sasiksham Sahano Yas Chandasam Buya Bhunaya Pradhivi Vyomit Pricham Chaham Vedam Ansuchisam no Dvadisham no Mahit Jadit Jano Itarani Trayum Satisham no Mitrasam Varunasam no So Om Shanti Shanti Ari Om Aitri Opanishadi Siksha Valli Samapta No Ananda Valli Babu Gauri, time I pay up and I will try to finish everything today of this Upanishad. Hari Om Sahana Vavatu Sahano Gunaktu Sahaviryam Karavavahai Tejasvi Navadhi Tamastu Ma Vidvishavahai Om Shanti 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 Brahma Vidapnoti Param Brahma Vidapnoti Param Param means transcendental, highest. A person who knows Brahman, Brahmajnana, will achieve the highest. Brahma vidha apnoti param tadesha bhukta. What is Brahman? Satyam jnana manantam brahma. The definition of Brahman, that is God, Ishwara, whatever you want to name, you want to use, is satyam jnana manantam. Three principles. 
it is not a person it is not a personality it's not individual but it is truth knowledge and infinite satyam jnanam anantam brahma yo veda nihitam guhayam parame vyoman who is hiding in the cave of your own heart in the transcendental space parame vyoman so ashrute sarvan kamaan saha he who acquires that brahman will get all his desires fulfilled brahmana vipaschite ti tasmadva etasma akash atmanah akasha sambhuta now the creation process cosmology is being explained from self atman comes the akasha space akasha vayuhu that is there is nothing only space is there and of course energy may be there so from that vayu the gaseous state of matter comes akasha vayuhu vayo ragmihi of course from uh, gaseous state agni is also there so through agni agner apah liquid state adhya prithivi then solid state prithivya oshadhaya then all plants oshadhibhyo annam oshadhibhyo annam food and annat purushah man comes out of food from the plants plants come out of prithivi and prithivi came out of apa apa came out of vayu sir apa came out of agni and agni interacted with vayu and then before that was akasha and akasha came from atma pure consciousness this is the cosmological sequence and in the paniniya ashtadhyayi sutras in the first prachara sutras hayavara la that sequence is given hayavara tlan hayavara ha is akasha bija ya is vayu bija ra is agni bija ya is Uh, why is uh, apa bija and la is prithvi bija same sequence was explained there also so this is the most profound sequence creation sequence sa e sava esha purusho anna rasamaya tasyedam eva shiraha ayam dakshina pakshah ayam uttara pakshah ayam atma idam pucham pratishtha tatapya esha shloko प्रजा प्रजायंते अधो जीवन्ते ये ब्रह्मोपासना जाताजयंतेजाजयंतेजाजयंतेजाजयंतेजाजयंतेजाजयंतेजाजयंतेजाजयंतेजाजयंतेजाजयंतेजाजयंतेजाजयंतेजाजयंतेजाजयंतेज
तस्य देत श्लोको भवति नो अबाउट प्राण प्राण देवा अनुप्राणंति मनुष्य पशवश्चये प्राणो हि भूता नामायु तस्मात् सर्वायुष मुच्यते सर्वमेवत आयुर्यन्ति ये प्राण ब्रह्मोपासते प्राणो हि भूता नामायु तस्मात् सर्वायुष मुच्यते इति तस्येष एव शरीर आत्माय पूर्वस्य तस्मात् वा एतस्मात् प्राणमयात् अन्योंतर आत्मा मनोमय नौ प्राण लाइफ इज डिवाइन देवस यू नो गेट लाइफ एंड ह्यूमंस मनुष्य पशुस्त एनिमल्स ऑल आर ओनली बेस्ड ऑन लाइफ प्राण प्राणो हि भूता नाम आयु व्हाट इज लाइफ लॉन्गिविटी आयु आयुर्दायम is nothing but prana pranam poindi means gone pran gaya bolu to aadmi mar gaya tasmat sarvayusham uchyate it is called sarvayusha because it is a life giving energy sarvam etat ayuryanti yav pranam brahmo vasate prano hi bhutana mayuhu tasmat sarvayusham uchyata now from that pranamaya atma tasmat va etasmat pranamaya अन्योंतर आत्मा मनोमय मनस्कम्स फ्रॉम अन्ना प्राण के फ्रॉम प्राण मनस मनोमय तेष पूर्ण सवा एष पुरुष विध तस्य पुरुष विधता मन्वय पुरुष विध तस्जुरे शिव ऋग् दक्षिण पक्ष सामोत्तर पक्ष आदेश आत्मा अथर्वांगिर सपुच्छम प्रतिष्ठा तदप्यश श्लोको भवती नौ चतुर्धनुवाक और द्वितीय अध्याय आनंदवल्ली यतो वाचो निवर्तंते अप्राप्य मनसा सह आनंद ब्रह्मणो विद्वान न विभेति कदाचने मोस्ट प्रफाउंड स्टेटमेंट वेर द वर्ड्स रिटर्न बैक द नेचर ऑफ ब्रह्मन सच्चिदानंद के नॉट बी एक्सप्लेन इन वर्ड्स वेर द वर्ड्स रिवर रिटर्न बैक निवर्तंते यतो वाचो निवर्तंते अप्राप्य मनसा सह वेर द माइंड आल्सो कैन नॉट रीच आनंदम दैट इज द नेचर ब्रह्मणो विद्वान न विभेति कदाचनेति व्हेन यू रियलाइज दैट यू आर आनंद रूप चिदानंद रूप शिवोहम शिवोहम सो व्हेन यू रियलाइज दैट You will not be afraid of anything. Na viveti kadachane the never. Anandam Brahmano vidwan. The nature of Brahman is anandam. He who knows this will be free from all fears. Tasseesh eva sharir atma ya purvasya tasmat va e tasmat mano maya anyo antara atma vijnana maya. From the mano maya atma comes vijnana maya. From the mental. to the intellectual or scientific or higher level mind vijnana ta esha purna sava esha purusha vidha eva tasya purusha vidha tamanva yam purusha vidha tasya sraddha eva shira rutam dakshina paksha satya muttara paksha yoga atma mahapucham pradishtha tad esha shloko bhavati vijnanam yajnam tanute karmanu tanute picha विज्ञान देवा सर्वे ब्रह्म ज्येष्ठ उपासते विज्ञान ब्रह्म चेद तस्माचे न प्रमाजति शरीर पाप मनोहिवा सर्वान्न कामान समस्मृत शरीर आत्मा यूर्व तस्मा विज्ञानमया अन्योतर आत्मा आनंदमय नो विज्ञानमय आत्मा इंटेलेक्चुअल साइंटिफिक रिसर्च लेवल इंट्यूटिव क्रिएटिव लेवल ऑफ द सेल्फ व्हिच इज हायर देन जस्ट ऑर्डिनरी मेंटल लेवल एवरीबॉडी हैज अ माइंड एनिमल्स आल्सो हैव सम प्रिमिटिव माइंड मंकीज हैव सम माइंड ह्यूमंस ऑल हैव माइंड बट दैट्स नॉट एडिक्वेट फॉर इंट्यूशन क्रिएटिविटी आइडिएशन रिसर्च इनोवेशन that is vijnanamaya higher level so that vijnanamaya atma has been explained vijnanam yajnam tanute 
कर्मा तनुते विज्ञान देवास्वे ब्रह्म ज्येष्ठ ऑल दि देवास् आर एट द लेवल ऑफ विज्ञान विज्ञान ब्रह्म चेदा तस्मा चे न प्रमाद्यति शरीर पाप मनो हिवा सर्वान्न काम समुत सो व्यक्ति विज्ञान मया लेवल ऑल डिजायर्स कैन बी फुलफिल तस्ेष एव शरीर शारीर आत्मा या पूर्व से तस्मा तस्मा विज्ञान मया आन्योतर आत्मा आनंदमय देर इज वन मोर लेवल ऑफ आत्मा विच इज आनंदमय तेव पूर्ण अथवा एष पुरुष विध एष दुस्य पुरुष विध नसन्न सभव्रह्मेति चेद वेद चेत अस्ति ब्रह्मेति चेत वेद सतमेन तदो विदुरी तस्ेष एव शारीर आत्मा पूर्व से अधा तो अश्न उत विद्वा संलोक प्रेत कश्चन गच्छति आहो विद्वा सोक प्रेत कशि समश्रुता सो अकामयत बहुश्याम प्रजाया ये सो द लॉर्ड नारायण वेन क्रिएशन स्टार्टेड हैड ए संकल्प बहुश्याम प्रजाया ये आई शेल बिकम मेनी इवन इन अवर केस अवर सन इज नथिंग बट अवर सन आत्मा वै पुत्र इट इज सेड इन द टाइम ऑफ नामकरण बहुश्याम प्रजाया ये इज अ वेरी ग्रेट फेमस कोटेशन लेट मी बिकम मेनी स अकामयता सह अकामयता ही desired that he will become many sat apotapyata sat apastapwa idagam sarvam asrujata having got that sankalpam he performed tapasya who the srishti karta then he created all these which you see ya idagam kinchat tat srushtva tadeva anupravishat whatever little he created he penetrated into it he entered into it tad anupravishya नारायण स्थित असद्वाइदमग्रवासी तथो वै सदात तदात्मा सयम अकुत तस्मा तत्सुत यदय तत्सुत रसो वै सह दिस अनदर फेमस कोटेशन रसो वै सह रस इज आनंद दि नेचर ऑफ ईश्वर ब्रह्म दि लॉर्ड इज रस रसस्य लब्धा आनंदी भवती आकाश आनंदो नदरमंतर कुरते अग्निंद्रो मृत्युर्धावती पंचम मृत्यु यम आलो उटरसीउटेडलीफिय so it is a commitment that's what yavas yuvasyat sadhuya va adhyayah asishtho dridishtho balishtha tasya yam prithvi sarva no there is anandavalli is being explained suppose there is a human being who is young 
that means full of energy and he is the entire emperor of the entire earth he has got so much power okay asishto dridishto balishta he is strong and tasyayam prithvi sarva vittasya purnasya with all wealth the entire prithvi is under his control he owns it sa eko manush ananda if you take that fellows ananda as one unit the maximum human ananda that is one unit and te ye shatam manusha ananda sa eko manushya gandharvana man 100 times of that one manava ananda is manushya gandharva ananda manushya gandharva means our musicians and singers they get into extraordinary ecstasy anandas is 100 times more than a big king or emperor who has everything and srotriyasya chaka mahatasya also a self realized soul also will have that level of ananda te ye satam manushya gandharvana ananda sa eko deva gandharvana ananda so 100 times the manushya gandharvas ananda bliss will be one deva gandharva that is a musician in devaloka srotriyasya chaka and again the srotriya akamahatasya who has no desires and so self realized soul is also at that level teye satam deva gandharvana ananda eka pitru pitru naam chiraloka naam ananda in the pitru loka one one ananda unit is equal to 100 such deva gandharva units srot and also srotriya satcha kamahatasya teye satam pitru naam chiraloka naam ananda sa eka ajanana naam devana ananda among in devaloka one unit is 100 times the pitru loka ananda and also srotriya satcha kam teye satam ajana naam devana ananda sa eka karma deva naam devana ananda among devaloka there are different levels karma devas are higher their one unit is 100 times the ordinary devanandas ye karma nana devana bi srotriya satcha kam atra teye satam karma deva naam devana ananda sa eko devana ananda even higher is devaloka just devaloka not karma devas but full devas srotriya satcha kam atra ye satam devana man 100 times the devanandas is indra ananda indra is a ruler of deva devaloka is 100 times the ananda one devananda and also srotriya satcha kam hatas a self realized soul who has no desires will also reach that level te ye satam indrasya ananda sa eko brahaspati ra 100 times indras ananda is one brahaspati ananda is guru srotriya satcha kam hatas te ye satam brahaspati ra ananda 100 times brahaspati sa ananda is prajapati ananda and again srotriya satcha kam hatu te ye satam prajapati ra ananda 100 times prajapati ra ananda eko brahmana ananda brahman श्रोत्रियुगाचाचाचाचाचाचाचाचाचाचाचाचाचाचाचाचाचाचाचाचाचाचाचाचाचाचाचाचाचाचाचाचाचाचाचाचाचाचाचाचाचाचाचाचाच
ಶ್ರುಣತೆ ಏವಂ ವೇದ ಇತ್ಯುಪನಿಷತ್ ಆನಂದವಲ್ಲಿ ಸಮಾಪ್ತ ಬ್ರಹ್ಮ ವಿಧಿಯೇ ಮದಿ ಮೇ ವಿಂಶತಿ ರನ್ನಾದನ್ನ ರಸಮಯ ಪ್ರಾಣಮಯ ಪ್ರಾಣೋ ವ್ಯಾನೋ ಅಪಾನ ಆಕಾಶ ಪೃಥ್ವೀ ಪುಚ್ಛಂ ಷಡ್ ರುಕ್ ಸಾಮ ಆದೇಶೋ ಅಥರ್ವಾಂಗಿರ ಸತ್ಯಂ ಯೋಗೋ ಮಹಾ ಅಷ್ಟಾದಶ ವಿಜ್ಞಾನ ಪ್ರಿಯಂ ಮೋದ ಪ್ರಮೋದ ಆನಂದೋ ಬ್ರಹ್ಮಪುಚ್ಛ ದ್ವಾವಿಂಶತಿ ರಸನ್ನೇ ವಾಧಾಷ್ಟಕಂ ಸತಿರಸತ್ ಷೋಡಶ ಭೀಷ್ಮ ಅಸ್ಮಾತ್ ಅಸ್ಮಾನ್ ಮಾನುಷೋ ಮನುಷ್ಯ ಗಂಧರ್ವಾಂ ದೇವಗಂಧರ್ವಾಂ ಪಿತೃಣ ಚಿರಲೋಕ ಲೋಕಾಂ ಅಜಾನಜಾಂ ಲೋಕರ್ಮ ದೇವಾಂ ಯೇ ಕರ್ಮಣ ದೇವಾಂ ಇಂದ್ರ ಬೃಹಸ್ಪತೈರ್ ಪ್ರಜಾಪತೈರ್ ಬ್ರಹ್ಮಣ ಸಯಶ್ಚ ಸಂಕ್ರಾಮತ್ಯೇರ್ ಏಕಪಂಚ ಸಿದ್ಧತಃ ಸೊ ಯಮರೈಸ್ ದ ಎಂಟೈರ್ ಥಿಂಗ್ ಇನ್ ಲಾಸ್ಟ್ ಪ್ಯಾರಗ್ರಾಫ್ ಸಹ ನಾವತು ಸಹ ನೌ ಭುನಕ್ತು ಸಹ ವೀರ್ಯಂ ಕರವಾವಹೈ ತೇಜಸ್ವಿ ನಾವಧೀತಮಸ್ತು ಮಾ ವಿದ್ವಿಷಾವಹೈ ಓಂ ಶಾಂತಿ 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 ನೌ ದಿ ತೃತೀಯ ಅಧ್ಯಾಯ ಭೃಗುವಲ್ಲಿ ಭೃಗುರ್ವೈರ್ವಾರುಣಿ ವರುಣ ಪಿತರಮುಪಸಾರ ಅಧೀಹಿ ಭಗವೋ ಬ್ರಹ್ಮೇತಿ ತಸ್ಮೇತ ಪ್ರೋವಾಚ ಅನ್ನ ಪ್ರಾಣ ಚಕ್ಷುಸ್ರೋತ್ರ ಮನೋವಾಚ ಮಿತಿ ತಂ ಹೋವಾಚ ಯಥೋ ವಾ ಇಮಿ ಭೂತಿ ಜಾಯಂತೆ ಯೇನ ಜಾತಿ ಜೀವಂತಿ ಯಶ್ಯಂತ ಅಭಿವಂಶದಂತಿ ತದ್ ವಿಜ್ಞಾಸ ಸ್ವ ತದ್ ಬ್ರಹ್ಮೇತಿ ಸ ತಪೋ ತಪ್ಯತ ಸ ತಪಸ್ತ ಆನಂದಂ ಬ್ರಹ್ಮೇತಿ ವ್ಯಜಾನ ಓಕೆ ದೇರ್ ಇಸ್ ಅ interaction between bhrugu and varuna varuna is his father and guru so bhrugu wanted to know oh, who what is brahman so he went and asked his father oh bhagavan tell me what is brahman anna or prana or chakshu srotram mana vacha all these things or uh, what is brahman by definition if anybody asks in future or in your examination what is brahman the definition is given here yato aimani bhutani jayante yena jatani jeevanti yasmin pravishanti tad brahma brahma is defined as that from which all beings are created all beings are sustained and all beings dissolve into srushti sthiti laya all the three actions same thing in brahma sutras janma adyasya yatah yato aimani bhutani jayante yena jatani jeevanti yasmin pravishanti tad brahma that which is responsible for creation sustenance and dissolution so varuna his father told you go and do tapasya so in our tradition everything will be achieved through tapasya so var bhrugu went and performed tapasya that means he meditated on what is it finally he got an answer what is that answer he got annam brahme divya janat annam food is the brahman because everything is born out of food without food nothing can born and everything is sustained in food and after dissolution everything go back into the same food that is mud annam brahme divya janat annadeva khal vimani bhutani jayante ye annena jatani jeevanti annam prayam ch abhishanti abhishanti iti tad vijnaya purareva varunam pitaram upasasara ಅಧೀಹಿ ಭಗವೋ ಬ್ರಹ್ಮೇತಿ ತಂ ಭೋವಾಚ ತಪಸ ಬ್ರಹ್ಮ ವಿಜಿಜ್ಞಾಸ ನೌ ವಾಟ್ ಇಸ್ ಆನ್ಸರ್ ಬರ್ಮ ಗೇವ್ ಈ ಡಿಂಟ್ ಸೇ ಎಸ್ ಆರ್ ನೋ ಈ ಸಿಂಪ್ಲಿ ಸೆಟ್ ಗೋ ಅಂಡ್ ಡೂ ತಪಸ್ಯ ಬನ್ಸ್ ಅಗೇನ್ ತಪಸ ಬ್ರಹ್ಮ ವಿಜಿಜ್ಞಾಸ ಸ್ವ ಯು ಎನ್ಕ್ವೈರ್ ಇನ್ ಟು ಬ್ರಹ್ಮನ್ ಥ್ರೂ ತಪಸ್ಯ ತಪೋ ಬ್ರಹ್ಮೇತಿ ಸ ತಪೋ ತಪ್ಯತ ಸ ತಪಸ್ತಪ್ವಾ ಅಗೇನ್ ಯು ವೆಂಟ್ ಥ್ರೂ ಒನ್ ಮೋರ್ ಸೈಕಲ್ ಅಂಡ್ ಕೇಮ್ ಬ್ಯಾಕ್ ಪ್ರಾಣ ಬ್ರಹ್ಮೇತಿ ವ್ಯಜಾನ ಪ್ರಾಣ ಇಸ್ ಬ್ರಹ್ಮ ಪ್ರಾಣಾದ್ಯೇವ ಸ ಖಲ್ ಇಮಿ ಭೂತಿ ಜಾಯಂತೆ ಪ್ರಾಣ ಪ್ರಾಣೇನ ಜಾತಿ ಜೀವಂತಿ ಪ್ರಾಣ ಪ್ರಯಂತ ಅಭಿಶನ್ ವಿಶಂತಿ ತದ್ ವಿಜ್ಞಾಯ ಪುನರೇವ ವರುಣ ಪಿತರಮುಪಸಾರ ಅಧೀಹಿ ಭಗವೋ ಬ್ರಹ್ಮೇತಿ ತಂಭೋವಾಚ ತಪಸ ಬ್ರಹ್ಮ ವಿಜಿಜ್ಞಾಸ ಸ್ವ ನಾವು ಸೆಕೆಂಡ್ ಸೈಕಲ್ ಅಗೇನ್ ವರುಣ ಟೋಲ್ಡ್ ಇಮ್ ಗೋ ಅಂಡ್ ಡೂ ತಪಸ್ಯ ವನ್ಸ್ ಅಗೇನ್ ಥರ್ಡ್ ಟೈಮ್ ಈ ಡಿಂಟ್ ಸೇ ನೋ ತಪೋ ಬ್ರಹ್ಮೇತಿ ಸ ತಪೋ ತಪ್ಯತ ಸ ತಪಸ್ತಪ್ವ ಮನೋ ಬ್ರಹ್ಮೇತಿ ವಿಜಾನ ವಿ ಆಲ್ರೆಡಿ ನೋ ಇನ್ ದ ಪ್ರೀವಿಯಸ್ ಸೆಕ್ಷನ್ ಮನೋಮಯ ಇಸ್ ನೆಕ್ಸ್ಟ್ ಲೆವೆಲ್ ಮನ
मनसो हेश खलिमान भूता जायंते मनसा जाता जीवन मन प्रवेदीज्ञा पुनरे वरुण पितरम उपसार अधी भगवो ब्रह्मे तवाच तपसा ब्रह्म विजिज्ञास स्वा Again, he went and told, "Manas is Brahman." Again, Varuna said, "Go and do tapas." Satapavata pyadatha satapas tapva. He again came back with one more discovery: Vijnanam Brahme Vijayanat Vijnanat Devas Hal Vimani Bhutani Jayante. From Vijnana, all beings are created. Vijnana ena jata ani jivan. That is the intelligence part. Vijnanam prayatyanti abhivanshante ati tad vijnaya. पुनरेव वरुण पितरम उपसार अधीति भवो ब्रह्मे तम होवाच तपसा ब्रह्म आनंदो ब्रह्मे आनंद इज ब्रह्म आनंदाध्यव खल भूता जायंते फ्रम आनंद ब्लिस ऑल थिंग्स आर बॉर्न आनंदेन जाता जीवन आनंद प्रयंती वारुणी विद्या भार्गवी वारुणी विद्या दिस विद्या दिस नॉलेज कमिंग आउट ऑफ भृगु एंड वरुण साषा भार्गवी वारुणी विद्या परमे व्योम प्रतिष्ठिता दिस नॉलेज दिस एनलाइटनमेंट इज इन दि Transcendental space. So, evam veda pratidishthati anna vanna do bhavati mahan bhavati. He who is established in this vidya, he will be great. Rajaya pasubhi Brahma varcha sena mahan kirtya. He who gets to that level, get tremendous reputation, gets all wealth of all kinds. Annam narindya tad bratham prano va annam. Annam is Brahman, therefore never abuse annam. Prano va annam sharira channa adam prane shariram pratishtitam sharire prana pratishtitam. In yoga shastra, we know prana. All of yoga shastra is called prano pasana. Prana yama. We will be doing the third month. Tadhe dhamnam anne pratishtitam sa eta dhamnam anne pratishtitam veda pratishtati anna va anna do bhavati. महान भवति प्रजया पशु ब्रह्म वर्चसे न महान कीर्तिया अन्नम परचक्षित तद्रतम आपो वा अन्नम ज्योतिरन्नाद आपसु ज्योति प्रतिष्ठित ज्योतिषा प्रतिष्ठिता तदेतमे प्रतिष्ठित सदमे प्रतिष्ठित वेद प्रतिष्ठति अन्ना वन्नादो महान भवति प्रजया पशु ब्रह्म वर्चसे न महान कीर्तिया अन्नम बहुकुर्वी तद्रतम पृथ्वी अन्नम आकाशो अन्नाद पृथ्वीयाम आकाश प्रतिष्ठित आकाशे पृथ्वी प्रतिष्ठिता तदेत अन्नये प्रतिष्ठित सएत अन्न अन्ये प्रतिष्ठित वेद प्रतिष्ठति अन्नावाद अन्नादो भवति महान भवति प्रजया पशुभिः ब्रह्मवर्चसे इति महान कीर्त्या न कञ्चन मनतो पृच्छा चक्षि तद्रतम तस्माद्या विधया ब्रह्मान् आदुध्य अन्न विद्या चक्षते So he is repeating again and again the same thing. Brahmavan bhavati tad brahmana parimatyuta pariyanam riyate. So evam vit asman lokan prechcha yedan anna bayam atman upasankram ya now transcending five levels. First is anna maya atmana transcending anna maya atma anna maya atman upasankram ya yedam prana maya atman upasankram ya yedam मनोमय आत्मा उपसंग्रम्येत विज्ञानमय आत्मा उपसंग्रम्य इमा लोकान कामानी कामरूप्यम असंचर साम गाय अहमन्नमहमन्नमहमन्नमहमन्नादो अहमन्नादो अहमन्नाद अहुम श्लोकृद अहुम स श्लोकृद अहुम स श्लोकृद अहमस्म प्रभम जाता पूर्व देंभ्यो अमृत नो मददा सदमी अहमिश्व भुवन अभ्यवाभवाज्योति वेद इतुपनिषत्
आराध्यते विद्युतिमाको वा एक एवं वेद एकम च वी हैव अंदर 15 मिनट्स हैं आई फिनिश भृगुस्तस्मै यतो विशन्ति तद् विज्ञासस्व तत्र योदन्नागम प्राणमयं मनो विज्ञानमेति विज्ञाय संतदापद्वादशकुं द्वादशानन्दैति नैषानि नरिंजात प्राण शरीरम अन्नम परचक्षेतास्यो ज्योतिरन्नम बहुगुरवीत पृथिवा पृथिव्याम आकाश एकादश एकाश संकंचक षष्ठि एकाशति ओं सहना सह नौ घुन सह वीरवाह तेजस्वीनावधी तमस्त मिषा वह ओं शांति 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 Thank you, Prabhu ji. Uh, now let's have uh, some interaction with uh, our revered speaker. Uh, anybody who wants to interact, you can raise the hand. First, we will take the people who raise the hand. After that, we will have uh, the open session for everybody. Okay, then now. Uh, even in the chat also nobody is interacting i think they are all uh, in a trance <laughs> so the veda mantras uh, mm. ch- chanted I, i have chanted uh, some samaveda mantras also that's ah who all that is samaveda yeah And it is very profound i mean you cannot explain in english 90% we cannot explain in english now out of uh, this 109 or 108 uh, upanishads uh, total how many we have covered and uh, so we we have we have covered only uh, three okay uh, ishavasya upanishad which is the first one yeah and mandukya upanishad which is the most profound and now we have covered taitri upanishad which is very large yeah. and which covers the entire education system okay. the convocation address and the five levels of existence Five levels of the self and five levels of Brahman, both are similar, both are identical, because the self is Brahman. I am Atma Brahma. So out out of this one, not eight, you have chosen these three. That means these are the uh, three top uh, most important. Yes, opening. yes. Actually, there are eleven. Eleven. Isha, Kena, Katha, Munda, Ka, Mandu, Kya, Treya, De, Treya, Brahma, Rani. So out of these eleven, I cho- chose only three because we have only three days. in the advanced course what we are going to have in the three levels we are going to cover each one in detail probably yeah actually 11 upanishads are very famous and because adi shankaracharya wrote the detailed commentaries <clears throat> out of 11 i have taken three so all the 11 can be covered and that is only vedanta not yoga so yoga upanishads is a separate story 20 upanishads are there and uh, vaishnava upanishads is a separate story shaiva upanishads is a separate story it's a vast uh, ocean of knowledge and how the modern hinduism the puranic hinduism in terms of the shiva temples or vishnu temples yagama shastra tantra shastra or shakti temples how it has come out from the veda is given in this upanishads like we have the shiva upanishads which explain the entire shiva tattva which later came into shiva purana linga purana and so on and the vaishnava upanishads which give vaishnava tattva which came out in the vishnu purana and uh, other vaishnava puranas and shakti upasana in shakteya agama vaishnava agama panchanatra agama so the in, uh, upanishads serve as the intermediate uh, stage between the vedas and the puranas thank you sir and uh, our challa chitti babu garu wants to ask yes uh, uh, namaskar and uh, i want to know the the five levels of uh, that you said about in the bhrugavalli that is uh, uh, annamaya atmanam vijnanam 
Uh, can you please say that uh, those five? Uh, Annamaya, Pranamaya, Manomaya, Vijnanamaya, Nalamaya. Manomaya, okay. Okay, now Gautam Ji. Uh, Namaskar Prabhuji. Uh, I want to ask that uh, five levels you uh, asked. Uh, Pancha, Pancha Pran you discussed. Uh, Prano, Apana, uh, Shamana, Udana, and Van. Van. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Van. Yeah. Van. Uh, there is another interpretation that there are 49 Una, Una Panchas, 49 bayus uh, in total. Is it true? And, uh, and uh, the second question is that no, what that, is. Uh, that is, yeah, please. is the, the, there are more, there, there are bayus. Dhananjaya Vayu, Kukul Vayu, they are the Nadi Vayu, they all come under Yoga Shastra. In, in the Yoga Upanishads, those things are explained more detailed. The five are the basic. So the basic five pranas, Apana is the one which is coming out of the body. Carbon dioxide, hydrogen sulfide, all these things which come out. Prana is oxygen. And Vyama, Udana, Samana, they are relating to different functions. And one uh, one remains till death, and after death it will go. So and the further classification of the functions into 49 or 18, Dhananjaya, Kokruta, and so many other vayus will come into picture. This is the yogic sir, and uh, Ayurvedic. Uh, sir, uh, that day I was uh, listening to a lecture from Shadguru. He explained that. Uh, one of the bio is told that if it is absent, so any uh, there will be gangrene, sort of on a, the uh, part of the body where this, uh, I think, a van he was telling about that uh, van bio uh, gets lost there, so it will it will be rotten, it will start rotting. And another he told that it is a uh, amount to jumping. So uh, if this uh, suppose it is he told udan, 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 it's similar to that yeah. pronunciation. So it is. If it is not there, you will feel yourself very heavy, heavy, and you cannot walk properly, and so on. All this, all these details are given in the Yoga Upanishads. <laughs> and Opan is the uh, is responsible for uh, you know digestive systems and so on. It is Opana. So Opana is Opana is excretion. It's coming out. Opana, no drinking, only uh, ejecting. That is no uh, products. The fourth chapter of Gita, Bhagavad Gita, is a stroke is Apane Junoti Prano, Prane Apano Tatapare, Pranapano Goti Rudja Pranama Parana. Yeah, yeah. It is the actual, actual pranam is that. This is the pranam, this is only about the Ura Pingala, and but the Pran Apana, that is the Susumba Prana. No, Prana Apana, he has explained in a Yajna form in the third chapter, fourth chapter. So that is explained as yajna. So putting apana in prana and prana in apana is a way of explaining. So we will be covering all this in the third month, which is a yoga course. Yoga course, yes. Uh, this Kriya Yoga that is uh, spread by uh, Samacharan Lahiri Maharaj. So it actually amounts to that prana, prana pranayama. Where no, no, pranayama. Pranayama is generic. See, please try to understand. All all knowledge, yoga included, have come out from Upanishads. So, yoga Upanishads, there are 20 yoga Upanishads are there. We have not covered now, but we will cover sometime later. And I already covered previously in some other uh, series in YouTube. You can see my name. You will get uh, yoga Upanishads. One lecture is there. So, in the yoga Upanishads, they have given all this knowledge which was later copied into other yoga texts, like Hatha Yoga Pradipika in uh, around 1280 and many other texts. So the practical aspects will be covered in our third month yoga course. And I'll be teaching what I have learned from my gurus. And every guru has their own parampara. We, 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 we nam do namaskar to all gurus. We don't want to criticize anybody. So their knowledge has come from Guru to Shisha Parampara. So whatever I have learned, I'll teach. Whatever they have learned, they will teach. They cannot teach what I teach. I cannot teach what they teach. But all are same. Finally, Yoga Shastra, it is in the Yoga Upanishads. And the other. They will we have to uh, say, next question. We have next question. 
can we have last next question mansi mule male namaste andi we are meditate mood lock is kal par na di chala basic question um ipudu ee paramparanta sans dwara tiskalali ani enduku chepparu ante oka vela mother ganka cheppunte మనకి మళ్ళీ ఇలాగా రివైవ్ చేసుకునే అంత నెసెసిటీ వచ్చేది కాదేమో అని నాకు అనిపిస్తుంది అంటే సన్స్ ఏ దాన్ని ముందుకు తీసుకెళ్ళాలి మదర్ కి ఏం రోల్ లేదు అని చెప్పడం మొదలే చెప్పాడు కదా నేను వాళ్ళ నా లెక్చర్ లో మొట్టమొదటి వెరీ ఫస్ట్ టైం ఇన్ మై లెక్చర్ ఐ షోడ్ మాత పూర్వ రూపం పితా ఉత్తర రూపం ప్రజననగం సంధానం ప్రజా సంధి so mata is given the highest importance even uh, in the knowledge is spread knowledge is spread anedi no, no. that is only because the sanskrit charu no because without a wife a man cannot procreate right so uh, the child the child who is born belongs to that man and that woman it doesn't belong to the doesn't belong to the maternal grandfather it belongs to the paternal grandfather the grandchild so then any yeah. spread of knowledge spread of knowledge yeah spread of uh, knowledge basically the idea is no no basically the idea is it is important to get married and procreate child that is it message is given because normally all the brahmacharis who have learned vedas they want to renounce the world and they want to become sanyasis mm-hmm. you remember in all marriage functions there is a kashi yatra mm-hmm. one function is there you know what it is yeah yeah that brahmachari <laughs> he has finished he has finished yes, his convocation yes. snatakam aipindi he has finished snatakam now he wants to go to kashi and settle there and perform tapasya and reach moksha he is not interested in this world so they he will be approached by the brother of the girl and said no no please come please come to our house you marry my sister etc 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 and request him to marry So yes, that is yes. the point is telling here you have finished the convocation this is a convocation address snatakam now you may go to gashi and perform tapasya or go to forest and himalayas go to himalayas and become a great yogi that may be your plan but not that you have to continue the lineage raja tantu ma anavacheddi don't break the raja tantu tantu means this yeah, can, lineage yeah don't okay. it means you don't interpret all kinds of can we have thank next, you, next you. question uh, yes, rajesh kumar tripathi ji ah, namaskar namaskar sir main rajesh mera bahut basic question hai mujhe to bahut zyada gyan nahi hai bas ye hai ki bhagwan se zyada mera hai lagav rehta hai jaise rigved atharved samved ye char ved hain aur ek upanishad hai jo aap kar rahe hain isse aapas mein log padhte hain aur lecture mein suna dikhaya jata hai hamara ye kehna hai ki jo gaon mein village mein jo kehte na bhagavad gita sunna hai kya wo bhi upanishad hi hota hai ya kuch aur hota hai में ये सारे उपनिषदों का मूल सार भगवदगीता में लिखा गया है हम भगवदगीता भी पढ़ाएंगे दो दिन के बाद हाँ। जी जी सर तो बस यही क्वेश्चन था थैंक यू सर ओके लेट्स हैव नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन फ्रॉम नरसिंह जी सर नमस्कार सर सर नमस्कार सर నమస్కార్ Fifty or more than fifty hours. Sir. Thank you, sir. Uh, just uh, I want to one. I want to discuss one thing, sir. Now the Sanskrit word Ananda is there. Now we got Ananda Maya Kosha. That uh, that Ananda, and also we have Yato Vacha Nivartante Aprapya Manasasa Ananda Brahmano Vidwan. There also Ananda is there, but this Ananda as it is bliss. but both are different is it not sir in anandamaya kosha it is uh, uh, laukika 
ఐ మీన్ వాసన బేస్డ్ ఇన్ ఎతో ఇన్ ఆనందం బ్రహ్మణ యుద్ధం ఈజ్ ట్రాన్సెండెంటల్ ఆనంద దట్ ఈజ్ బ్రహ్మానంద i would like to add okay uh, in the in the panchakosha anandamaya kosha is the last the subtlest so after that uh, there is no discussion that means it is the closest to the self the yes, the, the kosha panchakosha are one over the other yes, inner innermost is anandamaya kosha next is vijnanamaya kosha next is it is like wearing five five shirts so annamaya the, the anandamaya kosha is in, in their most closest to the self to me then vijnanamaya then manomaya then pranamaya then annamaya so i am carrying on in my life with all the five bodies yes sir and mm-hmm. the innermost that is i self he is in closest contact with ananda so in the panchakosha vichakshana in uh, this upanishad he has stopped at anandamaya kosha but later he told the statement yato vacho nivartante apra pimana sasa ananda brahmano vidya so you use the word ananda there that is brahmananda yeah brahmananda which is the fifth highest highest level of ananda but the ananda so kosha he is vasana ananda my kosha no no ananda my kosha is the, he is the last and within that the highest is brahmananda but we are transcending can, actually Uh, yes. from it is, you are transcending no doubt upasankramati upasankramati yeah, tra- from so, anandamaya kosha we are transcending to brahmananda it anandam yeah, brahmano yeah. vidwan at anandamaya kosha there yes, is no yes. there is no uh, i mean uh, brahma brahmananda right. anandamaya kosha no that is highest brahmananda yes. is highest level highest. of anandas and that that manushananda so, devananda and so on highest is brahman yes sir okay that's yes, sir sir thank you sir okay uh, one more you know when interesting question is uh, which is your favorite uh, upanishad that makes you feel brahmananda any <laughs> yeah this the taitri upanishad alone talks about ananda valli the gradations of another upanishad talks of uh, ananda analysis so okay and uh, how does human can attain self realization in this world or how to feel brahma is that there is any a, tip that you can provide that is the whole purpose for which we are delivering this uh, courses and lectures yeah so all this the, the entire thing is uh, that only be regular and then be attentive <laughs> and <laughs> do your self study i cannot give any guarantee but i can hope and i am planning and i am putting maximum efforts that all of you will reach moksham by the end of this course gagandeep wants to ask one question prabhu ji could you please tell us yes. while yes. delivering upanishad classes which specific books are you using he has already shown in the beginning but you can show him show him also. i am using the original text 108 upanishads only original text and i am also sometimes using the ramkrishna math books but uh, <laughs> if you go by ramkrishna math books it will take uh, one month for one upanishad like the three upanishad so today i skipped the uh, ramkrishna math book but took the original and i rushed through i skipped some of the things uh, vishalakshi garu might have realized that i have skipped the uh, <laughs> few things but i have no choice yes chaala chaala asal entha vivaranga cheppochu kani meeru chaala sankshiptanga kuda baa chepparu nenu tarvata next level lo cheptanu kada appudu చాలా వివరంగా డీటెయిల్ గా చెప్పాలి అనుకుంటున్నా వీటన్నిటిని కూడా ఈ దశోపనిషత్తుల్లో కుదిరినన్ని పాసిబుల్ కుడ్ యూ ప్లీజ్ షేర్ రెడీ రెడీమేడ్ యూనో షేర్ పాయింట్స్ ఆర్ పీపుల్ నో నో ఇట్ ఇస్ వెరీ డిఫికల్ట్ ఇట్స్ ఇంపాసిబుల్ టు మేక్ అవర్ పాయింట్స్ లైక్ దట్ సో ఐ సజెస్ట్ యు రీడ్ ది రామకృష్ణ మిషన్ బుక్ ఆన్ ఉపనిషత్స్ బట్ ఐ ఆల్్రెడీ షోడ్ యు I can uh, I think uh, there are no more questions yes so let us acha okay shall we you know go for prarthana and then uh, close with janaganaman um uh, vishalakshi ji garu can you uh, could you start this prarthana please 
ಪೂರ್ಣಮದ ಪೂರ್ಣಮಿದ ಪೂರ್ಣಾತ್ ಪೂರ್ಣಮುದಚ್ಯತೆ ಪೂರ್ಣಸ್ಯ ಪೂರ್ಣಮಾದಾಯ ಪೂರ್ಣಮೇವಾವಶಿಷ್ಯತೆ ಓಂ ಶಾಂತಿ 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 ಓಂ ಭದ್ರಂ ಕರ್ಣೇ ಶೃಣುಯಾಮ ದೇವಾಹ ಭದ್ರಂ ಪಶ್ಯೇ ಮಾಕ್ಷಿರ್ಯಜತ್ರ ಸ್ಥಿರೈರಂಗೈ ಸುಷ್ಟು ವಾಗುಂಸಸ್ತನೂಪಿ ವ್ಯಸೇಮ ದೇವಹಿತ ಯದಾಯು ಸ್ವಸ್ತಿ ನ ಇಂದ್ರೋ ವೃದ್ಧಸ್ರವಾಹ ಸ್ವಸ್ತಿ ನ ಪೂಷಾ ವಿಶ್ವೇದಾಹ ಸ್ವಸ್ತಿ ನ ಸ್ಥಾಖ್ಯೋ ಅರಿಷ್ಟ ನೇಮಿ ಸ್ವಸ್ತಿ ನೋ ಬೃಹಸ್ಪತಿರ್ದಾತು ಓಂ ಶಾಂತಿ 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 ಸರ್ವಾಂ ಸ್ವಸ್ತಿರ್ಭವತು ಸರ್ವಾಂ ಶಾಂತಿರ್ಭವತು ಸರ್ವಾಂ ಮಂಗಳಂಭವತು ಸರ್ವೇ ಭವಂತು ಸುಖಿನ ಸರ್ವೇ ಸಂತು ನಿರಾಮಯಾಹ ಸರ್ವೇ ಭದ್ರಾಣಿ ಪಶ್ಯಂತು ಮಾ ಕಶ್ಚಿತ್ ದುಃಖ ಭಾಗ್ ಭವೇತ್ ಓಂ ಶಾಂತಿ 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 ಸ್ವಸ್ತಿ ಧನ್ಯವಾದ ಡಾಕ್ಟರ್ ವಿಶಾಲಾಕ್ಷಿ ಮಹೋದಯ ನಾವು ಲೆಟ್ ಎಸ್ ಹ್ಯಾವ್ ನ್ಯಾಷನಲ್ ಸಾಂಗ್ ಯು ವಾಂಟ್ ಟು ಸಿಂಗ್ ಒಂದೇ ಮಾತ್ರ ಮಾನಸೋ ಇಫ್ ಇಟ್ಸ್ ರೆಲವೆಂಟ್ ಅಟ್ ದಿಸ್ ಟೈಮ್ ಆರ್ ಇಟ್ ಶುಡ್ ಬಿ ಸ್ಟಾರ್ಟ್ you decide and then at the end we can sing both okay okay whatever you feel correct <clears throat> let us sing and let's respect national flag or let us all stand up please today we'll sing national anthem and tomorrow we'll decide about the next okay ಜನಗಣಮನ ಅಧಿನಾಯಕ ಜಯ ಹೇ ಭಾರತ ಭಾಗ್ಯ ವಿಧಾತ ಪಂಜಾಬ ಸಿಂಧು ಗುಜರಾಟ ಮರಾಠ ದ್ರಾವಿಡ ಉತ್ಕಲ ಬಂಗ ವಿನ್ಯ ಹಿಮಾಚಲ ಯಮುನಾ ಗಂಗ ಉಜ್ವಲ ಜಲದಿ ತರಂಗ ತವ ಶುಭ ನಾಮೆ ಜಾಗೆ ತವ ಶುಭ ಆಶಿಷ ಮಾಗೆ ಗಾಗೆ ದವ ಜಯ ಗಾಥ ಜನಗಣ ಮಂಗಳ ಧಾಯಕ ಜಯ ಹೇ ಭಾರತ ಭಾಗ್ಯ ವಿಧಾತ ಜಯ ಹೇ ಜಯ ಹೇ ಜಯ ಹೇ ಜಯ 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 ಹೇ ಜಯ ಹಿಂದ್ ಜಯ ಹಿಂದ್ ಜಯ ಹಿಂದ್ ಥ್ಯಾಂಕ್ ಯು